Hey all, here I am with my completed Donkey Kong 3 Cabaret, serial number 0001. That's right, this is the one and only in existence. This is a uh, fantasy creation. If um, Nintendo had created a Donkey Kong 3 in their Cabaret form, in real life they only created the uh, Donkey Kong in Cabaret and some of their other older cabinets. DK3 was really pretty much only a kit in the standard upright, and of course they had cocktail versions too. So I decided to make Cabaret Donkey Kong 3, largely inspired by uh, club member Fetish Boy, Sean. Um, I took a lot of inspiration from his work, so thank you so much, and he did a lot of the cabinet work as well, so I owe him a lot. Let's take a quick tour. Side art, marquee, control panel, and bezel are all creations of mine. I um, took inspiration from others' work, Took inspiration from the original artwork, resized it, remade it. I'm especially proud of the control panel, the marquee, and the bezel because I added instruction panels there. We are running an original Sanyo 14-inch CRT, you can see. Um, coin door, go, door runs off of coins. Take a side, side are the same on, the, on the, both sides. Back door, of course. This is all pretty much exactly what you'd expect if you were to look at a real Donkey Kong Cabaret. But what we've got going on in mine is, if you look close at the control panel, you'll see two buttons. I am running CRT T Emu driver with a PC inside, mainly so I can run Donkey Kong 3, the other Donkey Kongs, and something I'm especially proud of, a game called Fix-It Felix 3, which is an entire creation of mine. This is the only cabinet you're going to find it in. I'm running on a real CRT. This game is my creation, completely original, um, based on Fix-It Felix, of course. Um, let's go ahead and coin it up and see if uh, see if we can see some gameplay. One sec. There you go. So in this game, you're controlling. It takes a lot of inspiration from Donkey Kong Three. Um, you're trying to get these keys to the top, kind of like in Donkey Kong Junior. Um, Meanwhile, Ralph is trying to get you down. Uh, pretty tough to play with one hand, but um, it's two-player compatible, runs off of coin play, different settings, and of course looks great on a CRT. Let's go back to Donkey Kong 3. This is the game I'll probably have it on most times running, so everyone just kind of thinks it's the real game that's always in there. Um, again, I'm using Groovy Main, CRT, Emu Driver, and Switch Res, so it all works with my CRT perfectly. Instead of a sticker, I'm using a light-up marquee. This is using LED lights with a tinted, um, I'm sorry, with a reverse printed plexi. Uh, so it looks fantastic lit up. Again, original Nintendo coin door. Let's go ahead and open that up so you can see inside. Give you a look, sneak peek on the electronics inside. We got a coin door, wiring. There's the power supply to build a uh, ISO transformer to run the um, 100 volt AC monitor. There we are using a JPEG for controls, a little audio amp. Uh, tried to keep the wiring as clean as possible, so not too bad. Um, could be better, I suppose. There you are, the Donkey Kong 3 Cabaret, the one and only in existence, serial number 0001. Let's go ahead and check that out. No one else has this. If you want to learn more about how I made it, check out my website, SergioStuff.com. Bye.